All right, we're here to we're here to tell you about the the Texas Long Range Shooters Texas Overwatch match on August the 27th. We've got enough time uh, to have two more big matches be before deer deer season starts here, and then we'll uh, we'll start back with matches again the first part of next next year. So we got time for two more matches. This match is on Saturday, August the 27th. And what we're trying to do is trying to get some actual real world con con conditions for you to shoot with your rifle. The last match we shot known, ra known targets at a known range in a known order. Now we have to shoot in front of the big gigantic berms here at Best of the West to be safe. So we cannot shoot an unknown range match. What we can do is we can take those ranges and have an unknown in engagement of those ranges. So that's what we're doing. Because if you were hunting, if you were up would come over a ridge or you were glassing and you had a big big bull elk or a, or a big trophy mule deer buck come walking out, you never know where they're going to come out at. So this teaches you how to be more familiar with your rifle, how to set or hold hold over your scope and it gives you more of a real world, world hunting con condition. So what we're going to do, we have five known ranges, 500 yards, 600 yards, 600 meters, 750 yards, and 1,000 yards. So we have five ranges. We're going to take a range card and write a range on it and put it in a bucket. So now this match is shooter's choice. You get your choice, you can shoot prone or you can shoot from the bench. So what we're going to do is once you're ready, the, the RO will draw one of the range cards that has a range on it. He's going to show it to the spotter that's keeping score, and he's going to show it to the crowd behind you. And then he's going to call out your range to you and punch a timer, and you have 30 seconds to engage that target. It's one shot, hit or miss. So then we, when, you've, when you've completed that shot, then he'll ask you if, if you're ready. He'll draw another card out. He'll show it to the spotter. He'll show it to the crowd. And then he'll call out the range to you and he'll punch the timer. And you have 30 seconds to engage that target. So he's going to do that for the five ranges in random order. So you, know, you don't know which yardage you're going to be shooting next. And it's more of a hunting type deal. Now our, now our guys over, overseas that are on Overwatch guarding our troops, you know, they never know what yardage th their target is going to come out at either. So this is more of a real-world apl application for your long-range skills. So it, your target plate size is going to change a little bit. We're going to go at 500 yards is a 12-inch round. At 600 yards and 600 meter will be a 12-inch square. At 750 yards is going to be a 12 by 16. And then we're going to increase the plate size at 1,000 yards. It's going to be 18 by 24 for this match. But this is a shooter's choice match. You can shoot bench or pro. There will be two classes. There are going to be 308 and less. And then there'll be the open class. So the open class will start with a, uh, a uh, you know, Hardy Ott 6 and the 65284. All your Magnum rounds, all of the, you know, 300 wind mags, 338s, all of your wind mags, and the, and the, the, the Winchester short mags, the Psalms, all of those magnum rounds will shoot in the open class. So we have two classes. It's the same course of fire, but it's really not fair for somebody shooting an actual 308 to be trying to compete in the wind with a guy shooting a 338 Lapua and a 300 grain bullet. So we're trying to keep it fair, and that's that's how we're we're going to uh, to uh, do it as two separate classes. Now the 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 when you come here, there's going to be a range fee that you pay to the range, and that, that's all they're getting for the match is your little range fee. And then the entry fees, we're paying back 90, 90%. So we'll take 90% of the entry fees, we'll get that number. We're going to split it 50% for first, 30% for second, 20% for third for each class. So there'll be six, six places paid, three for each class, and we're paying in cash. We're not going to write you a stupid check, we're paying in cash. So uh, the entry fee is going to be $49 for your first rifle and $39 for any extra rifles that you want to enter. 
you can enter more than one rifle. If you're going to be here for a while waiting to shoot, you might as well enter several rifles because it really doesn't cost that that much compared to what most matches cost. And then you'll be you'll be scattered throughout the uh, day shooting if you enter more than one rifle. So now now here spectators will get in for free. So you can bring the wife, the kids, the whole family, mom, dad, brothers, buddies, shooting buddies. Everybody can come watch you shoot. The only thing you have to do is you've got to sign in at the office and they will give you an actual ticket that, that shows them that you have gone in, you've signed in at the office, you give your ticket out here to the match, to, to the people running the match, but spectators get in free. It doesn't cost anything for the ticket. Now, when you're a spectator here, the range rules are you have to wear hearing and eye protection at all times. Now, as you can see, the firing line is actually re recessed down. Back behind the firing line is this, is, this is this elevated area. So we want the spectators and all the people when they're not competing and they're not on the firing line to be back up here on this elevated area. We're going to round up as many pop-up canopies as we can. If you have one, you're encouraged to br bring it along with you. And we'll have the spikes where you can nail it, nail it down. So we're going to have this area covered back behind here with as many pop-up canopies as we can round up. So bring a real comfortable chair, bring an ice chest, bring snacks, lunch, drinks, water, whatever. Bring whatever you need. Uh, they have snacks at the office, but they don't have hamburgers or anything like, like that. So bring your lunch with you. When you come in, since this is going to be a regular range day, and we're going to have this side of the long range, the rest of the range will be open. So in the last match, our actual, the people that were competing and the, and the spectators just overwhelmed this parking area. So what we want them to do is come in, and you can come up here and you can drop off your stuff, drop off your comfortable chairs, canopy if you have one, your ice chest, your snacks, your drinks, your firearms in the case. And you can drop it off over here. We're going to park across from Skeet and Trap so we, the rest of the range will be open. It's about 70 yards from where, where we're actually shooting from. It's not far. And you won't be carrying anything. You can come by here and drop it off. And then when you're done at the end of the day, you can come by here, bring your car over here, load everything up, and, and uh, go. But we have to keep the, the parking area here open. This is a regular range, range day. So it's going to be a really fun match. We're, we're, we're paying back 90% in cash. Nobody does that. And, uh, and I think you'll really end the, end, end the joy at the last match with a great group of, uh, of uh, people. So, so tell everybody you know, and be sure and tell them the spec spectators get in free. And their first rifle is only $49 to enter. We're paying cash. And we hope to see you on August the 27th.